welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to show you guys how to make a really really nice single chain bracelet in only a few minutes. Now let's get started. Okay so the things you'll need for this bracelet is a loom, some rubber bands of your choice. Here I have green and um, jelly blue. You'll also need a c-clip a metal tip hook or a plastic tip hook it's your choice but today i'm going to use a metal tip hook okay now guys this step is very important you want to make sure that your arrow is pointing outwards and not towards you if you do not do this step your bracelet will turn out wrong and it'll be all messed up and there'll be bands flying everywhere okay so once your arrow is pointing outwards you want to start with your first color which for me is blue and you want to start with this pin here and you want to go to the up left pin which is right here then you want to take your second color which for me is green and once you start from once you landed on this pin you want to start from that pin so you want to go here to the up right pin right there Again, you want to take your first color and you want to start off with that pin and go up left. And you want to take your second color and go up right. So uh, this is basically your pattern here. It's like a zigzag pattern. And you want to just continue this all the way to the end of your loop. And I am almost done here. And this step only takes about one minute because it's really really simple to do okay so this is what your loom should look like now once you are finished putting the bands on so so the next thing you need to do is make the arrow point pointing towards you now so now the arrow is pointing towards us and that is very important so you want to make a cat band so once I started I ended with blue I'm going to start with green so you want to double loop it on your finger and you want to convert it on this pin right here so you have to put it like that right there and the cat band is there so now let's start putting the bracelet together okay so you want to now start with your hook so you want to push back the cat band and bring bring your um, bottom band up and make sure your cat band does not fall off and you want to bring it to the up left pin just like that so that is what your um, pattern should look like now so uh, now you want to push back the blue two blue bands and bring up the bottom band which for me is green and loom it right here just like that that is what it should look like now again you want to push back your green band and bring up the bottom band and uh, loom that right here on this pin one more time, you want to push back your blue band and bring up the bottom band and put it up here. So you want to continue this pattern all the way to the end of your loom and make sure that when you're done, this is what it should look like. Th this is what the pattern should look like. If it doesn't look like this, then something is wrong. So I want to show you guys a problem that might happen to you while you're looming this bracelet and one of the bands fall off like that. You want to just bring this band here and just put it back on this pin here and everything should be fine. So I am now done looming my bracelet and this is what it should look like. Just like that. So on this pin here, it doesn't really matter where you put your C-clip. But you want to take your C-clip and you want to just put it on the bands like that and make sure that your C-clip has the two bands. So now you, you want to just take your bracelet off your loom. So this is what my brace bracelet looks like. So now you want to take the hook here and just um, hook it with these two rubber bands there. Now this is what my bracelet 
looks like and it's really really nice but there are so many other bracelets that you can make that looks really really nice but this is the beginner's bracelet and this is the easiest bracelet you can make so i hope this video helped you guys a lot and remember to thumbs it up and subscribe bye guys